I hope you guys are all doing great. This is the nail art design we're going to be working on today. We're going to be painting Mr. and Mrs. Frog. Let's get started. I began this design by applying this green nail polish by Santi called Vikini Green over my entire nail. Followed by this I'm painting an almond shape in the color black. This is going to be Mr. Frog's little face and this is just going to serve as an outline. Followed by this using a green color I'm just filling it in but I'm allowing that black outline to show all around. Followed by this using a small size dotting tool I'm going to be painting two little white dots above my almond shape. These are going to be his little eyes. Two tiny black dots for his nose and in the center of his eyes two tiny black dots looking downwards. Now it's time to work on his body. I'm going to be painting two black stripes going inwards and two black lines going downwards. These are going to be his little legs. Now I'm just going to be dividing his body in two with a white line and just outlining all around. These are going to be Mr. Frog's little pants. For his little toes under his little legs I'm just going to be painting three little black lines and on the top area of his body I'm going to be filling it in with the same exact green color I used for Mr. Frog's little face so it could all be uniform. For his arms I'm just going to be painting a black stripe going upwards and in the corners of this stripe I'm going to be painting three little fingers and I'm doing the same exact thing on both sides. Now it's time to fill in his body with the same exact green color I used for his skin. I'm just filling in the little toe area but I'm making sure to keep that black outline showing. This saves a lot of trouble so you don't have to go all around outlining your design or in this case Mr. Frog. Now I'm painting two black stripes. These are going to be his little suspenders and two tiny black dots as buttons. Now just add a little tiny smile for his face and that's it for Mr. Frog. Let's start painting Mrs. Frog. I started the same exact way by painting an almond shape in the color black and I'm just going to fill it in with the green color allowing that black outline to show all around. Now I'm going to paint her eyes a little bit different but it's just optional however you like. I'm painting two black dots above the almond shape. And let's move over to painting the tiny black nose, just two tiny black dots. Because this is Mrs. Froggy, I decided to add two round dots on the sides of her face. These are her little cheeks. And just a little smile. Now in the center of her eyes, I'm going to be adding two white dots. Now I'm going to be working on her little body. For her body, I decided to paint a little triangle and I'm just going to be filling this triangle in with a pink, a light pink color. and. You can basically do your shape however you'd like but I thought this would sort of look like a little dress shape. To finish off her eyes I'm just going to be adding two tiny black dots looking downwards and because this is Mrs. Froggy I'm just going to be adding two tiny black lines on the corners of her eyes for her eyelashes. For her little arms I'm just going to be painting a black letter C on the side of her triangle dress and a little line going downward for her little hand and I'm going to do the same exact thing on the opposite side as well. For her little legs I'm just going to paint two black lines going downwards and in the corners of these three tiny black lines as her toes. Now it's time to fill in her arms and her legs. I'm filling them in with the color green, the same color I used for her face and I'm making sure that the outline shows all around, the black outline. So I'm just going to fill in her little toe area as well. For her dress pattern I decided to add burgundy horizontal lines and this is what inspired me for the rest of my nail art design. I added the same exact pink background color with the lines going every which way. And that's it. That's how you're going to get this nail art design done. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and try out this fun nail art design using your favorite colors and your favorite patterns. Take care. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.